is Abby and I'm a first year at Emory University. And just a fun fact about Emory is that it's a 15 minute drive from Atlanta. So we still get that campus feel, but we're still close to the city also. And since I'm a first year, I haven't declared my major yet, but I'm thinking about majoring in neuroscience and behavioral biology on the pre-med track and minoring in English. So um, in a normal year, this room would be like a double for two people, but because of COVID, I have this double to myself. And um, starting this fall, I think Emory is going back to its traditional housing, so everyone will have a roommate. But I think that's just about it, so let's get into it. Welcome to my dorm room. So I live in Raul Hall, which is one of the newer residence halls on Emory's campus, so I definitely got the look of the draw. Um, I have a thermostat on my wall where I can adjust the temperature. Some halls at Emory don't have this actually, and the thermostats are only hot and cold. Um, I have a lot of closet space and to be honest, I definitely brought way too much clothes for my first semester and second semester. So I highly suggest reducing the amount of clothes you bring to your first year of college if you can. Um, so in the middle, I have some dresses and on the right side, I have clothes for warmer weather like t-shirts and tank tops. And yes, I am definitely running out of space in my closet. And above it, I have some uh, containers full of PPE and also some buckets of just uh, miscellaneous items like batteries and extra towels. And I also have extra soap up here. Um, it's a great space just to put all my extra things here when I don't need them. And below my closet, I have my laundry bag, some extra boxes for my um, labs that I do in my dorm and also my suitcase in case I have to go to the COVID hotel. Um, and next to my closet, I also have my robe and my shower caddy. Um, so next to my desk space, I have some canvases that were painted by my sorority sisters. And I also put up a lot of photos of my friends to remind me of home, so I made a little collage. So on my wall, I made a collage of notes from my friends and family because um, I need to pick me up when I'm super depressed and down about chemistry, so I love having them right in front of me while I work. And also on my desk, I have my laptop, a mug, and a calculator, and also a box on the side just for small things that um, I don't want to put in my cabinet and my pencil holder and a lot of spring allergy meds because I get really, really bad spring allergies. Um, I also have a iPad here with my Apple Pen and a pillow that says I love you to the moon and back from my big for my sorority. And I also hang my towels on the side of my second bed that I don't sleep on. So this is my desk area. And back to my sink, which is closer to my door, I have some of my skincare items lined up on the side, my toothbrush, and I really enjoy having this sink so I don't have to like go out of my room to, you know, wash my hands or wash my face, and it's really convenient. Uh, under my desk, I have my garbage cans and also a lot of extra plastic bags and hangers and also my shower shoes. Make sure to please bring shower shoes to college. You do not want to get, um, athlete's feet from the shower. I also lined up a lot of my shoes. All of my shoes are white. I think white shoes are the perfect match for any outfit, so I don't get any other color. Um, on top of that, I have my Tides pods, um, also a basket of masks that I can wear. I usually don't wear the reusable ones. I wear cotton masks and I have more cleaning supplies and laundry supplies on the top. Um, below this, I have my cabinet that is full of clothes and on the side, I have a lot of accessories like hats that I've been given. Um, this is an Embry mom hat. I have some headbands and um, scrunchies and also an extra purse and also laundry balls. So what I like about my room is that all the cabinets and tables have like a pull out section so you can like make a desk out of anything here. Uh, so this is my cabinet for all my jeans. And then in the cabinet below, I have a space for my skirts and sweatpants and also some extra t-shirts. Definitely um, a lot of clothes in my room. I regret bringing this much clothes again. I will definitely not do that next year. Uh, so this is my second desk. I started a little Polaroid wall. I hung up my uh, purses and backpacks on the side. Um, this is my Konkin backpack that I really like taking to class and these purses for when I'm going out. Uh, this mirror initially lights up, but it ran out of batteries, so I have to replace those. And below my desk, I have a vacuum, and this is a water boiler that I use for um, tea and ramen. On the other side, I have a little container for my necklaces and um, rings, so they don't get lost. And I also have earrings on the other side. 
and my Polaroid camera for my Polaroid wall. And behind my mirror, I just have a lot of skincare items because um, I love skincare. <laughs> so this cabinet is mostly just like free items that I've gotten from Emory, like um, hand sanitizer. Um, I really recommend using these blue sticky tape if you want to hang anything on your wall because they don't damage the paint. And for a lot of colleges, if you rip the paint off the wall, they will charge you like a hefty fee for it. Um, in this cabinet, I have some um, tea and some coffee. And here is my fuzzy carpet and here's my bed. So on my bed, I have um, some tote bags that are hanging off the side and this balloon that's definitely deflating <laughs> and um, a pink pillow on the end and everything pink pretty much. Pink is definitely my favorite color if you couldn't tell by now. Um, I put some flowers up and this is my view. Um, I'm on the second floor so I have a view of the quad and this is my stuffed animal bear and I also have a cloud LED light that I just added above my bed so it looks really nice um, above my bed during the night and I don't have to like walk all the way across the room to turn off the light and I can just turn off that pink light. So this is my second bed that I use for my friends if they want to sleep over. Um, I have like a few extra blankets and a nice poster that I got from Crog Street Market and I also hung some LED lights below it. It's really comfy up there. Everything's pink. <laughs> So below my second bed, I have a lot of snack items. Um, I definitely don't have the healthiest diet. I have a lot of Pop-Tarts and Brownie Brittle and Pringles. Don't judge me. Um, below that, I have some instant ramen and um, more snacks hidden in all these drawers pretty much. <laughs> yeah, a lot of open snacks. I need to finish these before the end of the semester or they're gonna go bad. And a pair of um, dishware. And I also have some of my lab stuff down here because I um, did a bio lab in my dorm this semester. So here are my lights again and blankets and an overview of my room again, my desk space. And here is my fridge. I have um, some items that I got from the Emory's Farmer Market. Um, I got fresh honey and marmalade, so I can't wait to eat these. I just got these um, yesterday. Um, Emory has a farmer's market every Tuesday and in my freezer I have some cheesecake and ice cream for when I'm also again sad about chemistry and I need to eat my heart out and here I have some of my mugs I have a niche mug and a pink mug I have a birthday card that I got from my friend and some additional fake flowers just to make my room a little more happy because I can't take care of real plants I have my charger and my starlight and also an air purifier that just like clears up my room if I ate something that like smells a little bit. Um, it clears up the air really easily and I don't like the smell of Febreze that much so I actually like my air purifier a lot. Um, and this part of my desk also pulls out so I put my Brita filter on it. And today it's pretty rainy so it's a little cloudy. So that's it for my dorm tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll put my Instagram and my email at the end of this video so feel free to hit me up if you have any more questions about Emory or college in general. And I hope you guys have an amazing week. Thank you so much for watching.